Secretary, are you a threat to national security? Forced out of her job after sharing a sensitive document from her personal email, Suella Bravman says she reported the breach rapidly. Some question this and say others flagged it. Reappointed Home Secretary by Rishi Sunak, Cabinet Ministers defended their colleague. Suella is a first-rate, front-rank politician. Uh, she acknowledged that a mistake had been made. Uh, she is working hard in order to ensure that our borders can be made more secure and that policing is more effective. Uh, and she's a valued member of the Cabinet and someone whom I admire and like. Suella Braverman initially shared the document at 7.25am on the 19th of October. An hour later, one of the recipients replied saying they'd been sent it in error. 90 minutes later, the Home Secretary's account sent a message asking for the email to be deleted. Then at midday, four and a half hours after the breach and two hours after the follow-up email, Mrs Braverman instructed officials to report the incident. You can't have a Home Secretary who is not trusted by the security service, who is not trusted with important government information, and it really shows the huge error of judgment that Rishi Sunak has made in reappointing someone just six days after she broke the ministerial code. There's also been criticism about a dangerously overcrowded asylum centre in Kent. The Home Office forced to deny reports that legal advice about moving people from the site was ignored. This all matters because it throws doubt onto Suella Braverman's competency and honesty and also calls into question the judgment of the Prime Minister. One former cabinet minister accused Rishi Sunak of striking a grubby deal to get her support and questioned how this fit with his commitment to transparency and integrity. Officials here at the Home Office are said to be livid and this isn't the only security concern around at the moment. The Mail on Sunday reported that Liz Truss had her phone hacked while Foreign Secretary with up to a year's worth of messages downloaded. The government hasn't confirmed this, but former intelligence analysts say security services need to have confidence in the cabinet ministers they deal with. If, if trust does break down, then then that's a problem. And that could, that could lead to, if not withholding of information, then some heightened briefing and conversations and discussions about the, um, the importance of making sure that the, the proper protocols and procedures and behaviours are followed. Since taking office, Rishi Sunak has brought a degree of calm to Westminster. But with big challenges ahead, the backlash to his choice of Home Secretary shows there's still ample space for anger and disagreement. Rob Powell, Sky News in Westminster.